because I've come for a few years in the past and there's not been very many people here and uh, it, this year it warms my heart to see that there's so many people out here. I've served from 1959 to 2002. There's so few people that are actually veterans, you know, only 1% of the population has ever served. So it's good that people can remember and come to organizations like this and, and have a parade or just to tell them that, yeah, we know you were here. I enlisted in 1961, served from 61 to 64. And I'm very impressed by, by the numbers this year. And, you know, we've dealt with COVID and we've been here on occasion when there have been two or three people here. But no, it's great to have all the folks back and a decent representation of, of military people in the parade. Well, my dad was a veteran of World War II. I feel like that they go and put their lives on the line for us, and you know, this is the least we can do for them. This is a tradition. On the 11th day of the 11th month of the 11th year, at 11 o'clock, we kneel. You know, we think the best way to recognize service, if you will, is to bring a world of peace. You know, so this, if we can have a world essentially where there are no more war veterans, that's what we're after. My entire life I can look back on the military as probably being the single most important thing I had ever done.